So AMD launched its first cDNA GPU-based accelerator, the Instinct MI100, last year, and the latest report suggests that its successor, the MI200, could launch this year. The AMD Instinct accelerators feature the cDNA architecture that is designed for compute-intensive and HPC workloads, and the second generation of these chips is going to bring a lot of new features and technologies. The details were posted by Kamachi over on his Twitter feed, and from the looks of it, the Instinct MI200 will be replacing the MI100 as the new flagship accelerator for high-power computing. Now, based on the naming convention itself, it looks like the MI200 will be twice as fast as the MI100. But to achieve this, AMD is expected to go all out with its MCM design. Now the Instinct MI200 is expected to be launching alongside AMD's Epic Trento chips. Now the Trento line is going to be a slight variation of the Milan chips for the supercomputer sector. They're not going to be similar to Genoa as the features in the next generation Zen 4 cores, but it should offer a range of new capabilities which we will learn about closer to its launch. Now as for the MI200, it's expected to launch in 2021, but we should expect it to be a late Q4 arrival since the MI100 was introduced in a similar time frame at Q4 2020. Now other than that, the AMD MI200 is listed as an MCM Special FIO Accelerator for HPC Cray X. Now that could explain where the MI200 name comes from. An MCM or multi-chip module design could mean that we're still looking at a Vega compute GPU, but two of them fused over the same PCB con and connected by a next generation Infinity Fabric interconnect. Now do note that AMD's cDNA2 GPU will be fabricated on the brand new process node and are confirmed to feature third generation AMD Infinity architecture that extends to the exascale by allowing up to eight way coherent GPU connectivity. Now, according to Coel Kant's dream coming via video cards, it is reported that the MI200 accelerator will utilize a new variant of the GFX 900 GPU architecture, which is Vega, known as the GFX 90. A, which adds supports for full rate FP64 compute capabilities. Now, once again, the AMD MI200 accelerator sounds like it will go ahead with Nvidia's future Lovelace MCM GPUs competing in that HPC market. And for more on this and other news, follow the link in the description and make sure you're subscribed and hit the notification bell so that we don't miss you in the next one.